Hey everyone, happy Tuesday. Today is Tuesday, November 24th. Yeah, November 24th. And um, today is the day we sent our lease. Max got a haircut, by the way. Max, show your haircut. Look at him, he looks smaller. <laughs> I cut his hair because I didn't want to go to the new place and have hair everywhere as soon as we get there. So, he got a haircut even though it's gotten a little bit colder here in Florida. Um, the highs are in the low 70s and it goes down to 50s at night time. So, it's cold for us. But anyway, um, yeah, we're getting ready. Um, I have to uh, stop at the bank um, and get money orders for the deposit and everything for the apartment and then we're going to eat some lunch and then we're going to go sign the lease and then we're going to go to the water company and have the water put my name over there and then we're going to go back to the apartment and um get the keys and then we're going to empty out our current full trunk um so we have um, our bed rails and everything in there as you can see Go on, go potty, Max. My bed is on the floor. Uh, ugh. Anyway, I got my bed down. My son came over yesterday. I got my bed off um, the rails so that we could pack the rails in the car. And then um, the TV. Um, I got that down. My son got that down. And that's what's left of the TV stand because I took it apart so we could move it. And that's the shelves over there and those black things. And then, um, yeah, um, I did get a, uh, I ordered a, well, Best Buy already has their, like, TVs, like, really cheap, uh, even though it's not Black Friday yet. But I got a 40-inch um, Samsung uh 4k ultra hd um television for 450 dollars from best buy and the only problem is is that it was not in store and i have to ship it it's coming on black friday which is the day after thanksgiving so i will get a new tv on friday um however i'm not sure if it's going to be kind of strange because i'm not sure if a 40 inch is big enough for your bedroom that's my dilemma because um the one that i had here before um was a 42 so i'm going smaller but i mean to get like a 49 or was it a 48 inch i think it was 48 um the same brand um you had to add like what 200 dollars to the price at 300 dollars. so i think the um the 40 inch was like I said, I a four four fifty, and then the forty eight inch was seven ninety nine. So that's the dilemma. It was almost four hundred dollars more just to get a couple more inches on it. So I figured, well, you know, um, I'll try to make do with that. But you know, this it just gives me a chance not to have to deal with the Black Friday uh, crush because they had the LG. It was the 49 inch. It's going to be on sale for 500, but um, I really, really didn't want to have to go ahead and uh, get in that crowd and try to fight for the TV. So Samsung, I know, has really good HD TVs. So I'm going to try the Samsung. Although I think Best Buy actually had the LG, but you had to have it shipped as well um, for 500 or maybe a little bit more. But um, yeah, the 49 inch would have been good, but I was going with the brand and the fact that it was $450, which is pretty much what I paid for the TV I had in here. Um, but that one's a plasma, and I was like, you know, a 4K TV for $450. Yeah, you know, Samsung. Yeah. So anyway, um, that's the plan for the day. We're gonna probably try to load it up one or two more times. Um, just to get some things over there today so that's less for us to do tomorrow because you know I don't want to spend the entire day 
uh, moving uh, tomorrow because last year and prior times we've moved that's what's happened we've moved um, like from morning to night time and that's just ridiculous so I've even gone as far as to um, try to clean some things up while while I'm packing and things <laughs> in this place so that you know I have less cleanup to do when it's come time to do that which is when the place is empty so I cleaned out the stove last night the inside the oven um, got that all scrubbed out and I started a little bit on my bathtub you know scrubbing all the mildew stains or whatever that's on the tub and um, yeah so I'm trying to get things done Allie had some stains in our carpet that I used to I have a little handheld a little carpet cleaner machine and I try to get some of that out which seems like it helps some so that's good so yeah and then here's the situation with boxes still I mean you know I guess you could say that I don't have everything done but I mean most of the stuff that's not actually packed I can just go ahead and throw in a box real quick it's not like it's gonna take me 30 minutes to pack it up so I got some things like laying around that I can just throw in boxes real quick to move it. So um, yeah, that's what's going on. Um, like I said, it's it's the part one of the moving day um, today, and then um, part two will come tomorrow, the big day with the truck and all. Um, yeah, so that's what's happening with us, and hope you're having a good week so far, and we will see you soon. So we're here at our new place right now. Just bringing some stuff inside, so I'll show you a quick tour. This is the living room. There's the dining room. I think it's a bit, well it is a bit smaller, but it just looks really small to me in here. And I got really, I don't know where the lights are at. <laughs> I got really spoiled with new appliances at the old place. So, um... This stove is kind of older. The fridge looks almost like the one we had before. And then I don't care about a dishwasher. I don't use it anyway. So, yeah. The main problem I see so far is that um, there's no pantry, which I already knew about that, but there's not that many cabinets. And somehow I have to fit all of our stuff in the cabinets. Um, our groceries, our food stuff has to all go in cabinets. So that's going to kind of stink. So, anyway, moving right along. Here's just that stuff. Allie's bathroom is bigger here than the old place. And her bedroom's a good size. So that's Allie's bathroom. And then her room is back here which is a decent size. The only thing she doesn't have uh, a walk-in closet this time. So here's my room and the dilemma is, see if these lights work, yeah. So I have a patio door back here, um, which the view is not so hot, but yeah. But um, I have a walk-in closet here, but most of it's going to be taken up by my washer and dryer. So, my dilemma is, is that this doesn't come off, and my washer and dryer is stackable. So, the problem is, is I'm going to have to unstack my washer and dryer so that I can fit that in here. And if I unstack it, it's going to be like way down here, and I'm going to have to try to... <laughs> bed down every time I do laundry unless I get pedestals and I don't know how much of those cost to push it up higher so yeah that's gonna suck but yeah so my walk-in closet is kind of there's a water tank my walk-in closet is gonna be kind of limited because the washer and dryer is gonna take up most of it so you see in my closet where we live right now I don't know what I'm going to do with all my stuff because it's not going to fit in here. Um, so my bathroom is about the same size as at the other place. Not so big. 
But this medicine cabinet is bigger because see it's got all these open up like this. So yeah, it's got three sections for that. Now you turn the lights off. And that's about the same size. And there's a window, so I can put up my palm tree curtain. But yeah, so that's the before picture of our new place. Um, and we're going to go back to the other place and grab some more things to bring over here. Um, so we can get some more stuff moved in. Hey guys, um, it's 11.17. I have to get up at 6. Anyway. <laughs> Um, this may be the very last time you see us in this place, um, because, um, you know, tomorrow we're moving out. And, I'm going to stop eating stuff off the floor. He's eating crumbs off the floor, I don't even know what it is. Anyway, um, I've just been trying to finish up packing. I got 90% of it done, but, you know, some things I'm just going to throw in boxes at the very end, because... This is a lot of work for anybody, especially if you have a lot of health problems. Because this has really, really been rough for me to do this move. Anyway, um, like I said earlier, um, you've seen the, our new place. Um, I'll show you again once we have it all fixed up and have it filled up. <laughs> which won't be hard to do since there obviously isn't as much storage space over there. So I have no idea what I'm going to do with all this crap. It's not gonna fit um, in that little closet. Like I said, the closet isn't so, it's not so small, it's just that the wash and dryer is gonna take up most of the space, um, and that's why it's not big enough. I think the biggest room and the reason why the rest of it is small is because the living room is bigger. So, I guess um, instead of making um, the other rooms a little bit bigger, then um, you know, they, they did that, but. You know, it's gonna, I'm really gonna miss this big bedroom here because this room is like really, really big. That's the corner wall and it goes all the way down to there, to the door, and then back around. All the way down to the wall back here behind me and then the wall with the window. This room has been the biggest bedroom I have ever had, ever, in a house, apartment, anywhere. And I'm really going to miss it because my new room is not as big. So, anyway, at least we got the beds together, the frames. So, once we get the mattress and box springs over there, we just have to throw them on top of the frame. So, that's cool. I wanted to get that done because it just makes it much easier. Because if nothing else, you at least have your bed ready when you're ready to pass out. Anyway, um, I'm going to get off here now because I need to take a shower and hopefully get some kind of sleep, which I'm not expecting to get much at all, if any, um, so I can move tomorrow. But um, I just wanted to check in with you guys and say, you know, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, thumbs up, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. And we will see you as soon as I'm able to get around to a video. We do get our internet turned on tomorrow um, at the new place. So I will have internet, but it's just a matter of recording and... Um, you know, uploading the videos while well, editing and uploading. So anyway, thanks again for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.